Hi, my name's Haig. I'm the writer and user experience consultant at Wave DNA, and in this video, I'm going to highlight some of the new features in Liquid Rhythm version 1.4. Previous versions of Liquid Rhythm all feature note editing, where you can directly enter notes onto the arranger. The beat form edit feature, new to version 1.4, lets you draw with beat forms or note clusters. And paint with them. You can multi-select these note clusters, move them around, and swap them for other ones. Completely transforming the feel of your beat with this much control couldn't be easier. You can also define the velocity simultaneously by dragging your mouse up and down while painting. Users of the Max for Live patch in Ableton Live 9 use Liquid Rhythm to edit clips in Live Session View. Now, with version 1.4, you have the ability to select and edit MIDI clips in Ableton Live's Arranger View as well to bring Liquid Rhythm to your live workflow. So you can make larger edits with fewer and simpler commands. Custom Instrument Type is a new enhancement to Liquid Rhythm version 1.4, benefiting users of the Max for Live patch. It lets you choose instrument family types, so Liquid Rhythm's pattern suggestion engine can cater to the tracks in your custom drum kits. The Sample Browser is a new tab in the library for standalone and plug-in mode that contains customizable paths to the audio samples you've curated and organized on your hard drive. Explore your samples and drag and drop them directly in Liquid Rhythm for a sound that's authentically yours. Compatible file types include MIDI, WAVE, and AIF.